lost and I'm not ready to really share that yet. So I decided to go with the first time I had sex. So the time I lost my virginity. Um, it was I was 14. It was with a 24 year old. I had a went to a double date, I guess you would call it now. Um, we we're hanging out at somebody's house. The girl that I was with, I did not know was sexually active at the time and her and her boyfriend went into one room and I was left with his cousin. Um, fine ass cousin. Fine. Um, and he didn't believe that I was. Uh, he kept trying me. Um, and I kept saying no, no, no. I kept trying to like be smooth with it. Like, nah, I'm good. Like, no. I'm good, and finally he, he got up on something, and I was just like, okay, listen, it's like this. I'm a virgin. And he was like, no, no way. There's no way that you're a virgin because, Blase, you hanging out with her. So I'm just like, no, I'm a virgin. No, 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 no. And he was like, no, cool, no, we we going to do this because you with her. No, for real. Um, so we got into the act. Um, We got into the act. And he uh, got into the act, and then he realized that, yeah, um, I'm a virgin. And unlike most people, they have, like, really, really bad stories of being with their first person or something like that. It was how they were too rough, or it was, like, prom or something like that. Nah, mine was, he was very, very romantic, very, very caring, very, very... Um, attentive I guess that would be the word for a 24 year old getting it on with a 14 year old um, he took his time and he was very passionate so it's probably the reason why I'm a passion, very passionate lover now Like I seek that anytime I'm with someone I have to touch and feel and I have to feel you close on me Like I have to feel you breathe I don't want to just hear you breathe I, I want to watch your face, I want to look into your eyes, I want to do all that real sensual stuff, um, but yeah, um, afterwards, uh, he wanted to take me back to Alabama with him, <laughs> um, I couldn't, of course, uh, and I really lost track of him, like, we never really talked after that, like, kind of is what it is, you know? Um, so thank you out there, uh, for showing me what it's supposed to be like, because after that, I've had so many experiences that were not as passionate and not so genuine, if you want to say it is. Don't be looking at my nose because I know I need to fill, but so genuine in a sexual act where I refer everything back to my first time. Um, and I think that when you're with someone and when in that act and when you're in that moment that you should explore every part of their body. Like there's so many places on a person where it's that hasn't been explored. And you'll be surprised of what your mate doesn't even know about their own body. So I was taught um, to experience every piece of a person. So, yeah. Um. Okay. <laughs> but, yeah. Um, so that's my story time um, of... When I lost my virginity, um, and uh, I'm gonna go get ready now. I'm gonna go walk to the store because it's healthy. Um, I'm hoping that I don't pass out because it's hot, and I gotta go get my feet done. Yeah, they're crying for attention. Um, I've been such, I've been neglecting them. I have mm -mm, such a tomboy when it comes down to stuff like this. That's just like, uh, I don't wanna go. But, um, I'm about to, so, uh, talk to you later. I'm getting messaged. This has been the hardest video to shoot all day because people have either messaged me or they have called me in the video or the maintenance man came and 
wanted to do stuff with the lights. Yeah. So, um, talk to you later. Bye. Oh, peace, blessings, love, and stay tuned for next story time.